Alright. Alright, VOD watchers, um, the on-screen chat is broken today, so, um, you're just gonna have to rely on me reading people's messages out before I answer them. Uh, otherwise you're gonna be alone. Alright, we gotta go back to the home base. Yeah, someone dies. I can't see. There are cars there, motherfucker. Yeah, no more of that. For now. No light heart. Shopping list. Yeah, no more of that for today. Yeah, we ended at a pretty good point. It's like exactly... The place I wanted to end at, like, five hours in, worked out really well. Come on. Yeah, Pool Legend. I'm pretty sure this is where you have to go after this point in the game. Oh shit, it's not? Okay, let me, like, backtrack all the way to, uh, where we ended off. I didn't go there immediately because I thought that coming back here would trigger a cutscene. Yeah, you get to save up your points during these streams. Yeah, I bought this from the PS3 store, ran like garbage. Yeah, the PS3 store version runs the, uh, the European 50 hertz version, so it, it literally just runs at 90% speed instead of 100. Same with, um, Nocturne. Okay, last place I was at was, um, oh yeah, I think I have to go back to Manapura, actually. Yeah. Okay. Eighty three point four percent speed. That's even worse than I thought. Gail. Why are you here? Sarah said something unusual. That you were in danger. Sarah said that? But how? She couldn't have known. Transpired. I do not comprehend. I see. We have failed. Let us devise a new plan. Plan? 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 How can you be like that? Our comrade died. Comrade? I do not comprehend. That's like the fifth time he said just that. Just ignore her. She's just pissed because her girlfriend got killed. What is pissed? Her girlfriend? Hmm. Gail's the fucking best. I think this is when we get him as a party member. We're going after Mick. Don't try to stop us. You have a point. I believe it may still be feasible now that he has left the Citadel. This is acceptable. I will now accompany you. Jojo Jobber from the green hair dude. Yeah, he's a. Uh... The art style in this game is very similar. All right, yeah, we're gonna want Gale in our party immediately. He's like the highest. He's level twenty. Everybody else is like level sixteen. And his skills are really fucking good. T uh, tier 2 wind skills. The first repel. Fucking Mudo. All this shit's really good. And force boost.
Yeah, that should be good. I think this is this is like the dream team for the rest of the game. Just about Surf, Gale, and Argilla is a really good lineup. Does Gale have an active mantra right now? No, he doesn't. Let's change that. I need to fix my skills. I still have the boss set up right now. Yo, Baker Doze. I am diving with this music love it. Hell yeah. Thank you for the bits. That's a lot of fucking bits. It's like fifteen dollars right there. I have no idea what these guys are weak to, I'll just kill them outright. Or miss. Running away. Oh, they're 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 actually afraid of Gale. If they're uh, if you have a high enough party member, they will run away because of the level differential. They're literally afraid of Gale. That's so funny. I don't want to keep this on. There's a boss fight coming up in like a, a literal second right here. God, I love being able to rearrange my shit. Yeah, I think it's everything. She doesn't have much right now. I wonder if I'm under leveled. Or at least, um, all the other party members are. Probably am just by a little bit. What is this one? Oh, shared karma. I have 30k. I don't know, I'm definitely gonna, yeah, I'm gonna get him on, um, thunder skills. Not only because I don't have any thunder right now, but because that's what Gale's weak to, so it's better to have him go deeper into this chart than go more into force. He'll get that in like a minute. Just because it's a low level mantra. This still locked here. How well equipped am I right now? Rations, revival gems, yeah, I'm good. I bought a bunch of shit at the end of uh, the last stream. As a member of the solids. He's afraid of Gale too, isn't he? I would be. See that man's biceps? Tree trunks. Played so much cages hanging thunder instead of Zeo. Yeah, true. These guys are weak to force. Oh, they are. Uh, I'm thinking of the wrong game. Who knows? Maybe we'll just run away after this. Yeah. Counter strike poison. Big damage without a weakness. Yeah, they're just gonna fucking run away. They could still put up a pretty decent fight, but they're just afraid of the level differential. You love to see it. It's gonna lure me in, I guess. Probably gonna be a force fight around this corner. Surf runs like Forrest Gump. Is this what Forrest Gump looks like? Yeah, 
ignore the um, the widescreen cutscene bugs here and there. What's up with these guys? Where the hell is Mick? Salty run back. Actual cows. Okay. Those guys are definitely going to be casting Mudo in a second here. Yeah, DDS remasters would be great. Oh shit, they already casting Dekunda? That's unfortunate. I want to do extra damage against Bat right now with this, uh, this combo skill. Gale has a uh, repel shield, so this combo is going to be even stronger than before. Wait, oh right, she God, he's even voiding earth right now, that's obnoxious. Please don't die, okay. Forgot that he did that. I'm going to have to do something about the cows then. I only get that slow down when I stream, I'll have to fix that. Yeah, it's the PCSX2. That was big damage off of getting poisoned, holy fuck, that was 133. Yeah, they still have that fucking earth shield up. Go Damski with the sub. My ward didn't work. Streamlabs is falling apart. Good being as up. Hey, well, thank you. I don't know why literally everything is breaking today. Maybe it's on Twitch's end. Oh, well, Bat's kind of constantly be spamming this uh, Earth Shield, so I won't be able to do much to him. I don't know if he's going to change his script when these guys are dead, though. I get the feeling these guys are weak against ice. No, probably just expel. Curse Gale so that we can start doing combos. I would get greedy and do that again. But Surf's about to die, I don't want that to happen. Do I have a item for shielding death attacks. No. Okay, now it turns here. Ah. 
Okay. Big damage then. There we go. That's like, that's such huge damage for this part of the game. That's all thanks to Gale's uh, Force Repel instead of his Force Void Shield. It's a higher tier of a uh, defensive spell, so you get a better combo out of it. going on <laughs> You're too late. That stupid girl's in Mick's hands by now. How do you know about Sarah? <laughs> There's a girl at our base who can help you control this power. Come with us. Come and see Sarah, please. You son of a not that they are a step ahead of us, if they know that much. They are planning to neutralize us using Sarah's power. How do you know that? Don't tell me that you... Worst dungeon logical. coming up? Yeah, true. She's just a girl who can sing. How dare you drag her into this mess? I do not comprehend. Logic demands the most efficient response to... No! It's not right! <sighs> I'll taste your flesh one day, woman! I'm gonna try doing the window capture for OBS. I might be able to figure it out. But we should return to base. Don't like the way he said woman, true. Yeah, that is, uh, he's quite something. Alright, time for you. Okay, new window catcher. Scuffed. Chat. I feel uncomfortable having an entire VOD with no chat. I feel like I'm doing a YouTube Let's Play right now. Okay, not that. Okay, it's not even giving. Okay, never mind. It's not even giving me the fucking option for uh, OBS as a window capture. I have an idea. This is gonna be real scuffed for a second here, but I'll get. I'll get it. Gotta color key this, it won't be golden. That worked out pretty well. Okay, let me just adjust it. Yo, that's actually really good. Okay, I feel way better about that. Kind of like this chat better. Yeah, I um, I could set something up like that, like native Streamlabs. I can make something work. Okay, I think that's a good size. Yeah, I'll just leave that for now. Okay not sharp. Yeah, well, uh, okay, Mr. Film Student. Film Student, you're actually in the field. What am I saying? This'll do.
It's, yeah, it's nice to have a chat box that doesn't um, have the outline behind it. Okay. Immediate force fight after a boss. I should have done something with my setup. These guys are weak to uh, fire, I just realized. I just remembered. I don't have any uh, fire items. This is going to be a slog. Shit, okay. Yo, bitch. This is a direct deposit into the rehab account. Yo, thank you. Hidden in the reads for 500 bits. I don't like how how much that chat can cover the screen, though. Do you see that shit? That was like all the way across all the fucking enemies on screen, though. God. I'm gonna make it really fucking small. So if people really fucking care that much, they can... They can squint for it. Yeah, that'll, that'll have to do. God, what is up with Streamlabs today? Really flattening my cock. I don't like it when that happens. Gale's asleep. Everyone's asleep. Fuck me. I don't even know if I'm gonna upload this to YouTube, or at least have it, like, be listed. God, if I had... Maraji, I'd be owning everything right now. Because all these guys are weak to fire, I'd just spam that over and over again. I forgot that there was an immediate force fight after that boss, though. This game's a little brutal with that sometimes. Just do this the old-fashioned way. Guaranteed crit off of getting set to sleep. Everyone's getting put to sleep today. That's Streamlabs. didn't kill. What is with these crits, dude? Oh my god. So what happens when you don't have fire spells? Or even a Molotov item? Let's just wake him up. The, the reason why they probably have an enemy that cast revert on you but tweak to guns is they probably just wanted the fucking player to use that skill to like try using guns for once they probably knew that nobody was gonna that a bunch of people were gonna sleep on them all right just do this old-fashioned way what i wouldn't do for a dodge right now Yeah, I'm getting fucked up because I don't have any fire skills.
But at least they have low health, so a taunt physical skill will clean their cocks real fast. I could probably just one-shot them with a taunt Zanma, though, just because we have a force boost. Yeah, it's like more than half the health. Ooh, you hate to see that. This is going to be real bad. Yeah, and that'll fucking get- Okay, I cannot believe we didn't die from that. That could've been way worse than it was. Okay. There we go. I'll think consider that was not nearly as bad. I can't believe we just haven't died. Outright. We've been getting close to death, but haven't quite died. Okay, that poisoned horse is gonna kill himself. So I don't have to worry about it. Double combo attack. I've never seen that before. die after this. There we go. It's like literally one more. Alright, well we're hanging in there. Let's see if this hits. Nope. It's a good thing I've got media at least. Hey, we got the dodge. I'll be surprised if this kills. Nice. Right, we got something out of it. I could cure the sleep. I just forgot, actually. Yeah, that was a slog. That's fine. Does being asleep bypass accuracy checks? What do you mean bypass accuracy? Does it make it so that... Do you mean, like, can't miss the person who's asleep? It's no matter what, yeah. I think it, um... I, I, I feel like I've seen a sleeping party member dodge. I know that you can do it. There's a skill that lets you do that. Like, there's a skill that makes it so that if you're asleep, you get 100% evasion. I just don't know how it works by default. I think I've seen a sleeping party member without no sleep uh, get a successful dodge in. I feel like I've seen it done without that skill. I don't know. God, our Jill does such a low damage with the power. Hopefully we'll be able to kill them before that comes out. I still got doubles in right now. I need to reset. I keep not uh, fixing surf skills. It's so annoying. Yeah, this track is great. 85. And he got a stomach ache on his first hunt. Well done. Man, I can stun you? I forgot about that side of that uh, status effect. Ooh. 
God, we have no MP right now. This is ridiculous. Just get this kill and fix, up, fix all that. Are drain skills linked to any magic type, or can they be their own type? What do you mean? Gonna be playing DDS2 if you complete this. Oh yeah, back to back. And then by the by the time I finish DDS2, Nocturne will be out, and then I'll stream that. Oh, by drain you mean like HP, MP drain. I thought you meant drain is in like drain shields. Yeah, they're um. I think HP drain is almighty and MP drain is mute. It's weird. At least in this game, one of them is considered to be a mute skill. It's like a weird exception. I need to get to a restore point before I do anything else. Get my normal skills back. Yeah, I think I go for life bonus if I'm going to use Vile Blade because it's relative to how much health I have. It's a weird skill. That's much better. I just have no fucking MP right now. I'm gonna just field heal with these. And keep going. Yeah, Ciolo is weak to ailments in general, so he's definitely gonna be weak to that. Ain't seen this game in years? Hell yeah. Welcome back. If it's an optional boss, you can you can talk about optional bosses. I don't mind. Right, three of these fucking dudes. You love to see that. Orochi has empty drain of eight turns. Holy fuck! I haven't done that boss. But I don't plan on it. He's like the big turtle, right? He drained CO 14 times? Oh, that's fucked up. So, like, on every single turn, he just targeted CO because he was weak to that, right? That's fucked up. Forgot multi target spells or combos. What do you need? Uh, it's, it's weird. You need, like, um. It's kind of arbitrary. Hama, media. Mazio is Zio and Bufu. Aji is Aji and Zan. It's weird. It's like a combination of two different skills. We'll just give you the the multi for that one skill. It's weird. Kind of arbitrary. Spend the extra MP on the, the combo skill variant, or the um, the AOE variant for that. Even if it's on a single target, that would have been really nice to have in that fucking horse fight. This curse. Now. 
It's the third... The third void shield is what causes the game to slow down while I'm streaming. It's funny, I tested that before the start of the stream to see if it would slow down, but it only... Only when I'm streaming is there enough stress on my CPU for that to slow down, I guess. It's so annoying. Here, let me, um... Fuck with a... Speed hack setting. Maybe I could get it just slightly over the edge for that. Fucking PCSX2. Make a good emulator challenge. I have all my speed hacks on, okay. Oh well. This will kill. Do you have anything thunder? Yeah, impossible. True. Thankfully, thunder shocked enemies uh, doesn't nullify the devour like freeze does. Oh, everybody has their mantras. I didn't even need to do that. Tried eating a frozen chicken patty. Yeah, I, I like that they fucking make it so that you can't eat a frozen enemy. It's a really cool little narrative touch. They should have made it so that when you devour a shocked enemy, the um, the character takes damage for doing it. That also would have made sense. Just on a single target on the third deck. Oh, well, just hit everything. Let's focus on uh, something I forgot to mention. Um, if we kill enemies in as little turns as possible, we get a money bonus instead of a AP bonus. So let's start going for some money kills. Because everybody has their mantras right now, anyways. Why am I- I unlocked that already. Keep going. Am I gonna have to run all the way up there to unlock that? Yeah, I'm gonna have to run all the way fucking up there just to- yeah. Wow. Like DDS before Nocturne when you went combo skills were also instant kills and Nocturne lost your mind. Yeah, I played Persona 3 before playing DDS, so that wasn't a shock to me when it was back to being an instant kill again. I definitely prefer the DDS way. I don't know why it's not like this in every other game. Percentage based damage is really sensible for this kind of thing. For a game like this, instead of just two fucking insta kills, dude. She has no MP. Please don't kill him off of a fucking Mudo. Thank god. Okay. What's up, Senpai Edgy Spoon 001. What a name. Welcome back. No fucking MP. Please just. Yeah. Yeah, Atlas realizing that it's smarter to make light and dark its own damage dealing element and having just the instant kills be like special spill special skills is pretty good. Using all my fucking shacker drops. Those will stop being a delicacy soon when I uh, get easier ways of getting MP back, like uh Can I not get these encounters, please? 
Yeah, Xanadu. In this game, it's the other way around, where you'll have, like, special skills that are expelled type that just deal damage instead of uh, the other way around, like Xanadu. You have to go really far out of your way or get the combo skill for it. Devour mana, yeah. That's a whole ass skill slot, though. No, oh, these guys are gonna get melted. Hold up. Do I have a... Our Jill has my man. I should have gotten. Uh, why didn't I get monsters at the save point? Shit. Oh well. Focus on quick kills. At least this time around, I have the. Uh, what? They're weak to. Much better than the Kelpies earlier. The dodge. You're getting hit for that one. Yeah. Uh, 99 magic last word surf. Very fun. I'm divvying up my stats this playthrough so that I can just have, like, the best of both worlds. But in DDS2, I'm definitely going to be going full magic. I wish I had Maz Zanma right now, that'd be nice. Gotta be worried about the stealth, though. I'm gonna use my time to heal. resources to deal with us right now. Do I don't have any mantras though? I do get a lot of AP off of this. I'm almost tempted to load back, honestly. And, um, yeah, I'm actually just straight up gonna load back to that save I made and get those mantras. I'm also gonna switch my controller, because this DualShock is just too fucking big, honestly. The sticks. My thumbs are, like, stretched so far to get both my fingers on the sticks, that shit annoys me. Okay. Let's get the- let's get that AP. Let's get that bread, quite literally. What does Curse do? 10% of max HP on every action? Yeah. You, uh, you take damage off of doing damage, and insta-kill, like, Mudo skills will just fucking go right up your ass. Okay, let's get that bread. Nice and sleek DualShock 4. Of course, for some reason, PCSX2 has forgotten what controller I'm using, and the, the left stick does not work anymore. What is wrong with... left? Cool. Let's get these mantras. This fight's a big opportunity for a lot of AP, and I don't want to miss that. I reset because I didn't have any uh, any mantras on my characters, and I was missing out on a lot of fucking AP if I committed to that. I need to start scraping more into the the buff section down here.
at our jail on Taranda as well. If we get two Tarandas, I think that equals a uh, Dekaja combo skill. Yeah, much better. Audio dying on your end? Oh, that's just your end. It's really off key. Oh yeah, refresh the stream. Uh, Twitch does this thing where it fucks up the audio because like you you must have buffered here like like one time, and so what happens is Twitch automatically speeds up the player to try to catch up over time. It's really dumb. I should have put taunt on. Our jail has no MP, goddammit. This game is suffering. They just made the last mistake of their life. They just gave me a lot of fucking damage output. Should have dealt with that. There's a way to turn that off. Um, if you have FFZ, there's an option to disable the speed up. It's really annoying. God, everybody's cursed. This is cursed. Are they just gonna spam this? I'm just gonna discurse our jail and kill them. That's a mic. Yeah, CO is good because he doesn't have a, um, he does, he's, he's weak to every status effect, I don't know what you mean. That's literally the only thing he's weak to. He's weak to every ailment. I don't know, he said that the opposite way around. 148 off of a normal hit, it's because they, they taunted me. everything. Oh my god. Holy shit. Okay. Better not miss. Okay. 
Let's just focus on getting everybody revived so that they get it AP. Jesus Christ, that was scary. I killed two out of three party members right there. That's a kill. That was a not kill. Some other than kill surf. Look at that. Sheesh, okay. That was rough, but we made it. Yeah, lots and lots of reinforcements in these fights. But it works out really well if you have uh, AoE skills that they're weak to. Just a low on MP on everyone. Yeah, those are some seagull noises. I don't know. They, uh, they really cheaped out with the demon noises in this game, probably because of, like, disc space. Every demon in Nocturne has their own unique uh, sound effects, but there are a lot of uh, generic reused sound effects for demons in this game. It's weird. Yeah, that's if you know that the enemies are coming, yeah. Or you just save and reset. to rip the game in half to fit it. Yeah, I mean, I guess DDS1 and DDS2. I feel like that was planned, though, like, well in advance, that it was just gonna be a two-part thing. I need that restore point, like, right now. How do you decide which mantra to give people? Uh, it's just whatever skills I want, really. exactly what the goal is on this revisit, so I'm just gonna go up and then go down. Because there's a, some space over there I didn't get to already. Any plans for Gale skills? Mostly getting him down the Thunder Path so that he can eventually get um, Electric Resist. Yeah, the, the, the most solid play, I guess, in terms of planning out mantras is just teaching your party members the elements that they're weak to. Because it's pretty ironic. But, um... The reason why you do that is, like, at the very end of the element path, you'll get a skill, a passive skill, that nullifies their weakness to that element. So it's just really worth uh, setting them down that path. But in general, it's good because if the... If the party member that's weak to electric has electric drain always in their back pocket, then it's really good to uh, set them up like that. Rather than having your Thundercaster uh, have to cover another party member's weakness, this is more convenient. What the fuck are these guys weak to? Better be fire. Alright, they're weak to Thunder. Shit. It's probably gonna be like 700 of them in this fight. I guess I have these. Yes, yeah, surf, surf, water. It's like water, ice, kinda. Oh, we have a Mazio combo. Okay, we're just moving. Oh my god. I don't have Devour and Surf. I keep fucking up. Love to see that. Oh, four of them, huh? Check this out.
Big gains. Mazio without the combo. Let's do that. Oh, Gale is quick escape. I could be abusing that. First and foremost, though, let's get back Taunt and Devour, because that helps a lot for getting things done. Yeah, the, the Dual Shock Forge is far more comfortable in every way, just because it's a smaller, sleeker controller. Devs said at some point they want to take the best elements of Nocturne in 4, Duology for 5. Yeah, I think I remember seeing that article a long, long time ago. Didn't they say specifically something about, like, the demon raising of 4? I only very, like, vaguely recall. Yeah, they got that Persona 5 money. They better fucking go all out in this game. I don't have Secunda, these nuts, so I might as well get there real quick. Have Argilla go down this line, have Surf go down this line. Seems like a safe bet. building nocturne yeah uh that's an l right there i do respect the idea of going for a magic building nocturne but they really just like make it not worth in the end demi fiend's physical skills are just that much cooler i almost feel like it was intentional because of how cool his physical skills are M meanwhile like if you do a magic build the only cool animation you end up getting is um magma axis and like every other animation is just the generic spell cast possible in every route except for true demon and yeah don't you need like pierce for lucifer can't have any confidence in that until the game comes out i mean you could just it's been out just not in the language that you know takes too long to beat lucifer yeah I like physical builds, so it's not really something that bothers me actively. I think all I have to do for the dungeons is literally just this, get, literally just get out. Yeah, so I have to go all the way around. Yeah, imagine picking magic over for a cudgel, true. I've never done true demon ending. The only I've done one playthrough Nocturne, I did uh I did um what is it called? Neutral, I guess. Resurrection freedom ending? I don't know. The one where you make everything normal. Freedom? Okay, yeah. That's the only one I've done. So that doesn't have nearly as much 
content you have to do. No. If you, I feel like if you don't get the quick escape, then it just says retreat and you don't get it. I'll try it one more time. Why didn't I hit this earlier? I don't want to fight Yahweh. Yeah, yeah, should be a straight shot to the end now. Probably one more force fight down here. Preemptively get everything set up. Gale has a uh, force repel, so Argillo doesn't need that slot being used up. Earth. I definitely don't want to taunt him. I'm doing it. I'm going in. I will tar under it to soften the blow and then I'll revert Argilla. Jill might be a bit rough because she's the healer and this is a big damage boss. Let's uh, just go for like a triple Taranda. I don't have enough turns to get back to her. Let's just do a buff round. Ooh, that's huge. And fucking stuns. Yeah, we will just use these turns on reducing damage. Bit risky play here, but I'll go for it. All right, now he's back to minus one. This would have been a good play if I if I remember what this boss was. It would have been a good play to have double uh, Tarunda equipped, so that I could like just rush down taunts and uh, lowering the the damage that I had just increased. This should do a lot if I'm right about this weakness. Yeah. That's big damage. I'll take it. As long as nobody's under like 80 health, we should be fine. Holy triple stun, that's very unfortunate. I don't think it matters if you do combo skills though. I shouldn't miss. This might though. Yeah, 84. I don't. I have no idea what he's gonna cast, so I'm just gonna rush down damage. I might be able to kill him before he does that. There we go. 
Big damage. I go back to uh, the base now. No, nothing in here. I thought there was something in here. Drake, where are the combo skills? Yeah, doesn't Nocturne have like a hard cap on uh, magic damage? Isn't that why the whole magic build thing is really bad? It does? Okay. Yeah, I, I don't know. I'm just glad I always go with, like, physical builds. I did physical build for DDS 1 and 2 on my first playthrough, and uh, physical build is really cool in the end because of the animations that um, Surf has. That's about it. Magic is definitely better though, in DDS. Why did I get. I thought that was Momo Tower. Whoops. I saw the M and I went in. There are penalties for leveling up in Nocturne. Accuracy and crit rate goes down with the level. That's crazy. That doesn't make any sense. I didn't know that. What happened to your other party member? He ran away. He's somewhere. He's probably back here, actually. They force you to use Gale, so they have they have heat runoff for a bit. Yeah, I think what he he comes back here because they they attack the base. That's what happened. Yeah, it's all fucked up in here. You protect one girl. Huh? Why are you gonna be so rough on Cielo, dude? I'm sorry. I... <clears throat> Why are you so concerned with Sarah? You do not know, do you? I'll kill you. <clears throat> That's enough. It is not just heat. You have all changed since Sarah arrived. You may be confused, but do not blame Cielo. Cute little speech. But what about you, huh? I have not changed. I am myself. The solution lies in Sarah's lost memories. Instead of simply lashing out, let us think. Where is Sarah? They allowed you to live in order to give us that information. Where is she? The northern yeah, ruins. Violence, say otherwise. Heat. He cannot succeed alone. He should follow. I. <laughs> I want to come along too. I got to redeem myself for all this. Hey, Buddha. You should rest here. You won't be much help if you're hurt. Let's walk. 
We get him next dungeon, but not this dungeon. It's time to go into the worst dungeon into the game, by the way. It's time for point one thirty six. Heat just got auto leveled to level twenty. I just realized. Because he's out of the party, now he's back in the party and he's level twenty. I think heat for now is gonna because I, because I have a physical build surf. I am not gonna be seeing a lot of heat in the party. I think it's gonna be these guys for most of the rest of it. To make awakening true. Full fucking health, finally. Full everything. I feel like this is a good run. This uh, this setup: Devour, Vile Blade, Mirage, Helm, and Taunt. Taranda covers all my bases. Double Taranda is really good defensively, so I'm gonna keep that on Argilla. Elect Boost, Force Boost, Gale can be the uh, the lead. Damage dealing magician. What are his stats? He has, he gets a. Gale is pretty balanced in terms of uh, strength and magic, but his magic is a bit higher right now. Void elect force repel. Argilla doesn't need that skill anymore. When do I get the spyglass? It'd be nice to analyze off of any party member. drink. Spyglass, there it is. So the Spyglass is an item that um, gives you the analyze skill so any party member can analyze. Here, let me uh, get the full moon to 8 so that I can sell things at full price. Hope the moon phase is going up and not down. Or else we're going to be here for a while. God damn it. Alright, 6 out of 8 is good enough, never mind. I'm not gonna do laps for 30 minutes just to get a little bit better prices on these cells. On that one cell, actually. Gonna teach Surf me to have me the dedicated healer. If I if I did a full send magic build, I would have done that, yeah. But I didn't do that, so I'll just have Argilla be the healer this time around. Well, I'm getting called by a number that says spam risk. This is the second time. One second. Actual spam. Restore all MP. I think I'm gonna want to keep that. God, why do they keep calling? Hold on. They're very persistent. I don't know what this is. Throw my phone across the room. Okay. You gotta love when uh, your phone says you got a spam risk call and they it's an Indian accent calling from saying it's from Amazon. It's like, yeah, okay. No shot. See, I've gotten spam calls before, but never three times in a row, plus a voicemail. I was like, what the fuck?
First time here, loved your videos on YouTube, hell yeah. Welcome to the stream. Sorry, Shan, that was you. Long Forgotten Ruins. Worst dungeon in the game. Was sorry the Minnesota Fats joke. That came that's a joke from Vine. Um there's a Vine that was literally that, that seven second Minnesota Fats video, but um for some reason it got flagged as sensitive content. What makes this the worst? Uh it's got a confusing layout, like a fucked up puzzle in it, and uh most importantly, no good music. Hey, how'd you get in here, little kitty cat? <coughs> Sorry, my little friend. The guard not one let us outside this room. Listen to that Persona hey, 5 guitar in the background. Me? If I open this door, Gale will eat me alive. It isn't me. It's a... Uh... The cat. The cat's doing it. I think he wants to go outside. The cat? You mean a cat cat? Yeah, that cat. Oh, he's so cute. Come on, let him out. Ah! Yeah, what is up with all the black cats in SMT, Drew? <laughs> nice work, little bro. Yeah, the, you, the, the theme for this place is literally just this. Welcome to Destiny Land's beautiful mystery castle. The story to be told now is that of a beautiful princess and two princes. What dramatic conclusion awaits you along this path? Now, open the Dominion the door. models? I think they are. They look very the familiar. I'll, I'll get to go look at him in a second here. Yeah, totally not Disneyland. Destiny Land, isn't that from SMT1? Tokyo Destiny Land. If I could look up, I'd get a better look at that. It's definitely Dominion's pose, but the model looks a bit different from that demon. This is the one field theme that uh, Choji Miro did not make. Pretty sure this was made by um, who's the the classic composer for these games? Does everybody have a mantra? Let's get heat something just so that he doesn't. You have nothing throughout the game. Yeah, the, uh, what I mean by classic composer is the, the composer for like the older SMT games. He did some tracks and like a very small number of tracks in this game, like half the tracks in Nocturne. I'll see you, Marvin. Yeah, I'll be streaming this like all week. Okay, let's proceed. Ever gonna stream Final Fantasy? Maybe one day. I don't know. I don't really plan on it. I'm more of an SMT guy in terms of turn-based games. Yeah, 
switch tracks, if you remember off top. Definitely the Fiend theme. And the uh, Amala battle theme. Yeah, Kenichi. Just pixie. Are any of these supposed to be open? What the hell? Do I even get any encounters right now? Excuse me? Talk with the pixie first. There is no response. Now we have Dikaja, that's really helpful. Like, I can taunt Dikaja if I want to do something crazy. I think he voids this. No, he doesn't. Here, let me, before I kill his ass. I didn't buy the Spyglass, did I? Shit. Yeah, it's probably the picture. Side of the room, man. There we go. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Forgot about that. Twinkle Bell. This dungeon has a lot of uh, light beam puzzles, like the, the DMC3 light beam thing. It's got a lot of that in here. I think that this is a uh, falling puzzle. Like you fall through the floor if you do the wrong thing. <laughs> yeah, real creative. I think that was literally the gimmick of the last dungeon as well. He's just ribbon. Yeah. Get it? Suck the game. The only reason why this is a bad dungeon is because the music is lame. It'd be a total game changer if it were cool. Like, if, if, if there was at least a banger to listen to, it'd be much better. Imagine taunting me with uh, 30 strength. I think Gale's demon design is my favorite of the five. He's got that fucking. Flesh poncho. It's cool as fuck. What the hell? I'm getting turned around. Does this shit actually go anywhere? Demon cow.
These games always has, have such good, like, normal animation, normal attack animations in them. Nocturne especially. That's just because you do a right hook and deal, like, 700 damage. Oh, literally all I had to do was turn left instead of right. Still in the basement. Oh, this is fucked up. It's probably the worst possible start to an encounter you can get because not only was I not in human form, but. or not in demon form, but I got attacked first as well. Mahama will destroy these guys, though. Please don't hit. How is that gonna hit, dude? Alright. I think I go for it. I already got lucky that time. This curse a two-turn Mudo. Uh... The first curse will inflict a status effect, and the second, the if if a party member that is cursed gets hit by Mudo, then it's a guaranteed instant kill. It's also a status effect that like makes it so that when you do damage, you take damage. Yeah, I think we got lucky with the um, with the retreat there. Yeah, these are good. For for what they are, these uh, stock sound effects for the demons are good. At the very least, memorable. Advanced poison? Yeah. Alright, all we gotta do is just not step in front of the, the paintings. I think this guy's weak to Mudo. Off the top of my head. I don't think so. Rage? What is that fucking boss? Baboon with a hat and a book. Don't forget about the book. Alright, just gotta look around the corners so that we don't walk into a painting. Yeah, if I walk forward, I'll get fucked up. I have no choice. It's a one-way door. <laughs> Classic SMT moment right there. What's this guy gotta say? You are boned. Get it? Yeah, the older SMT games had uh, normal attacks, like normal enemies that could uh, lower your level in random encounters. Alliance and Demon Souls had a move that would grab you and you'd lose a level. It's fucked up. Okay, I found a weakness. These fights go by a lot smoother when you know their weaknesses. If you don't have them, it can be a pretty big slog. Let's see what a 51 game. 
Gail something now that he finished that mantra. Do I get him working on this or do I get him working on buffs? Maybe I have him go down the, the death line, perhaps. Oh, I know I should get heat. I should get heat, mutual karma, above all else. That's not mutual karma. Does he not have access to it? Oh, you need, um... I think you need, like, a deep mantra to get access to this. Yeah. Guess I'll just wait on it for now. He's higher level than anyone else right now, so I might as well. But what were we, what were we gonna get Gale? Why aren't you devouring them? Um... I didn't get a, um... I didn't get them frightened, so I wasn't sure if it was just gonna kill them or not. It's not too big a deal to just worry on killing them quicker. There's actually a good bonus for um, just killing them fast instead of setting up devourers. If you kill them faster, you get more money. So you don't have to worry about it every time. You always get AP anyways. It's just if you end up frightening them, then you'll get, um, you'll get an AP boost if they're frightened as well as extra damage off the devourer. So I just kind of do whatever is suitable for the moment. Yeah, let's, let's get him going down this line. Death resist would be nice. Every SMT game got a 4 out of 5 or a 5 out of 5 when it was on X-Play. Yeah, it seems like they, um, between that and the, uh, the SMT Nocturne has screwed us again a bit. They probably knew what was good back in the day. Sheesh, it's a small life. What is a unicorn? What are these guys weak to? Are they weak to death? Oh yeah. When you get that camera angle, you know it's gonna kill the enemy. There's a special camera uh, movement for when the enemy is gonna get killed. I'm gonna go get the spyglass. I forgot to buy that. And there are no vendors in here. I've got to go all the way back to the base. Because either that or I waste a skill slot in Argilla to be able to analyze. Since I'm not 100% on knowing weaknesses, I might as well get this now. Before I get too much deeper into this place. Gross Brain Optimizer Brain made you devour dudes every fight. Yeah, it's, it's a pretty good game for that sort of thing. There are downsides to like devouring everything though. One of them being um, the wrong place. One of them being that you don't get as much money, because not only are you spending more time setting up devours, but you're also um, getting your mantras so quick that you're always spending money. So there's there's like a lot of different ways to go about optimizing this game. It's got give or take in both directions, stuff like that. There we go, Spyglass. Only 5k. Yeah, there's a lot to balance in this system. That's why being able to one-shot everything with magic isn't necessarily the best way to go about it either. Yeah, this game is a lot of fun. It's got a really good gameplay loop. It's got more nuances in it than just spam weakness and do all-out attack. Lol. Hey, what's up, Day Navar? Are you winning something? Forgotten about this place? Yeah, this is a forgettable dungeon. I really don't like it. It's the worst part of any playthrough of this game. In my opinion. If it had cool music, it would have been a different story. Unite. 
Yeah, Luigi's Mansion, basically. I just passed, whoops. Yeah, look at that fucking camera angle, it's so cool. Why is this place called Coordinate 136? I don't know, it's, it's a, um... I think they just named this place based on the map location, I don't know, it's weird. Play your own music during the dungeon, I'm not gonna do that. Gotta get the, uh... Are we getting the yellow key? Depends. It doesn't take too long to get that, right? It's. I remember it being a good investment. Also, we are forced to fall again. Nice. That's what you gotta say. Oh no, bone pun. <laughs> SMT two disco music true. I like that this game lets you angle snap when you're walking by just holding circle and pressing L1 or R1. It's pretty nice. I think we take on. Oh well. Bonk. Megiddo. What business do you have doing that? How am I gonna. Oh, whatever. Alright. How would you not kill Monarchilla? Bonk. How would you. Oh, God, whatever. Bonk. SMT dancing game with Bikino. Did you know that in P3 dancing, um, there's an Embryon outfit for Igis? What does Xanadu skill do? It's um, AOE damage, AOE expel damage. It's weird. Yeah, hold on. Let me find this. This is a cool reference that they put in that game. Let's find this real quick. They have references to SMT 1, 2, Nocturne 4A, Digital Double Saga. Yeah. Yeah, look, that's the Embryon outfit. Sarah's outfit specifically. That's pretty cool. God, what? <laughs> Fucking dancing games, dude. <laughs> oh, we have a Jillo. Schmovin. Ooh, fire repel. Yeah, definitely put that on. Yeah, it's pretty nice to see a DDS reference because like SMT references are one thing that's that's pretty free in a Persona game, but um, DDS is a whole different story because it's a bit further removed. Do that again. You know what? Just kill him outright. Fuck it. It's up Scar Alien. Alright. I'm gonna focus on getting money. I don't wanna take the time to do mantras this time. Let's go for some quick kills just to get through this dungeon faster.
Eight skills can be set. Oh, hell yes, finally level 20. Genji could have a DDS skin. Dude, that would literally have my name written all over it. Fucking Genji DDS skin. God, you're speaking my language now. I'd get back into I would I would get back into Overwatch if that happened. At least they give you exclamation points where the pitfalls were. Oh. What is this guy weak to? Spyglass. Death? Okay, I was right. I just missed last time. I swear to God. I s Literally no choice but to fall there. These combo skills are really good right now. See, that's like still a lot of AP without even devouring anything. It's still good to just kill things and move on. Definitely faster as well and more money. So there's just a lot of different ways to go about combat in this game if you're optimizing. Right now I'm optimizing how to get the fuck out of this shitty dungeon as fast as possible. Yeah, physical animations are pretty good. All right, three turd axe. They're not going to see the light of day. And the crit. Wombo combo. Yeah, Demi Fiend's sliding punch is like the best animation ever made. Made even better by the fact that there's no recovery animation for him doing it. So like he'll he'll just do it and then he'll he'll keep his fist out there after connecting the punch and then the camera will cut and then he's just immediately back to normal. I like that quirk about these games is that they just don't put in the recovery animations. They just cut the camera and it's like everything's back to normal after doing the animation. Where are these? That's not that. Oh yeah, that was the shared karma thing, whatever. Power wave is good. I'm gonna do the hunt build for surf. Just get him some blizzard stuff for good measure. Huh, I won't worry about it now. Halfway through thrones. Okay, yeah, let's just do this. Yeah, it gives it character. It's something unique. I don't think I've seen in any other turn based game. Just a cool style. Camera angles in general are handled pretty cool in this game. Yeah, Spiral Viper animation in Nocturne is really cool.
Okay. Just don't fall into any holes. And don't go through any one-way doors that fuck me up. Why I do that? Mazio is the thing I gotta do. Please kill. Well done. Let's try one kill. Oh, well done. Oh, nice. Argilla has eight skills now. This is a Gunga Gunga gaming moment. Very true. I gotta start thinking about more combo skills they could potentially have. Let's do that, see if there are any combos accessible for that. Those skills. God fucking damn it, dude. I feel like I'm forced to do this every like two seconds. The real juice is probably this right route. Yeah. Rip. Going down again. Oh, at least there's a thing on the ground there. Yeah, back to the bone zone. Very satisfying combo to do. It's getting me through a lot of these encounters. Quantum cell. Yeah, that's worth falling for, I guess. You know what I should uh, get for heat? I should get media for heat so that I can use him as a backpack healer. Because he's not going to be in a lot of encounters going forward. Fade up a heal bot, true. SMT has a lot of good heal bot setups, especially in Nocturne. Oh my crit. Bro, this body, this fucking black ooze is fucking us up. This is ridiculous. Mind scream. End game fizz skill. gonna miss why I do that. Bro. Please dodge. Okay. Well, I usually didn't get critted that time. Sheesh. Base slime. Slimes just be out here in this game. For real. That was not this done. I don't have a disc done. Alright, game remove. She doesn't even have... Okay, I'm just gonna have to hold that L. I genuinely do not have a disc done right now. Weapon channel point commands. They're disabled for this stream playthrough because I don't want people redeeming goo goo ging -ang during emotional cutscenes. Alright, I'm just gonna have to hold the L for surf. Oh, I could just restore it here. There we go. 
That's much better. Yeah, so this entire left path is just bullshit, left and right. I'm guessing those those two corners that didn't go down just had uh, the bad painting, the bad paintings there. So that's why I didn't go there. Definitely planning on redeeming some silly shit. Yeah, I wouldn't blame you. It's just. Might as well just save those for the Kingdom Hearts streams and let people have these, this opportunity to build up points. We reward people for uh, watching some of those in Kingdom Hearts for once. this go? Oh my fucking god. Yeah, I could switch out Surf, but he's moving. Let's kill Mothman. It's a video where Mothman dies. It's literally just a one second video of Mothman getting killed by a demi fiend crit. You can just make it show up on screen whenever you want. Thank you, auto button. Kill Mothman 74. I've posted for like three different games a video of Mothman dying. I used to have a, a DDS version where he got consumed. I don't know where I posted that. Oh, a taunt? Okay, I see how it is. Oh, my taunt, man. That is fucked up. Okay, if he it, he could have killed us right then and there if he did another mind scream. What is with these oozes, dude? They're actually fucking me up so badly. And fucking Argel got stunned. It's fine. She's on support duty anyways. At least the restore points like two feet away from this door. Save? No, wrong button. So, where the fuck can I even go in this shitty dungeon? I'm just falling through the floor left and right, dude. I think there's a specific painting I need to get to. I'm gonna wanna fire spam this, so let's get um, Surf and Gale ready to go. Yeah, I could do a Mariagee and combo if I had more turns. Crit. Gonna fight the option bosses? Probably not, no. I'll do some of them in DDS too, because you can fight them along the way. That worked out well. 
Yeah, shoutouts to the um, the theme for getting ambushed. It's really good. Yeah, I think I know where to go. I just need to figure out how to not fall through before getting there. fall through the floor just because I'm stuck in this room anyways. Let's go this way. I haven't fallen through this one yet. At least fill out the map while we're here. God, this game has such banger themes and then there's this place. God, no quick escape. Let's pray for the misses. Alright. Let's get the spread. What the fuck was that noise? That's uh, apparently what they sound like in this game. God, they make menu healing so fast in this game. They added a shitload of like menu delay in SMT4 when you open up the Burroughs menu. So much delay between fucking inputs, it's so annoying in that game. Just to do something that's as easy as this. <laughs> Play music over it? No, thank you. See, think about the logistics of that, like, for one second. I'd have to stop it every single time I get into a battle, because the battle music is good. I'm not gonna fucking play music over the battle music just to play music over the field theme. Unless you want to hear two songs at the same time. Or mute the game entirely. I'm not doing this shit. Yeah, it takes ten hours to teleport between terminals as well. Yeah, I don't know. They, uh, cut out a lot of nice quality of life stuff in SMT4 while adding a shitload more. Also, 3DS is bad. It's melted. Now that Ergil has a uh, Mahama. This is nice. There's a blue painting. I think I need to get to the blue painting. I haven't gone through here yet. Here's a path I haven't taken. I like that it takes a turn to analyze in this game. It makes it worth remembering stuff. Weak to death, okay. I took off Mudo. Why would I take off Mudo on Gale? Yeah, weak to death. Ironic statement. Combo from a Zio. Zio Bufu. I'll do. 
Here he is. Should remember the route for this shit. I get out at least without falling into a hole again. Okay, well, I can't abuse his weakness, but uh, too bad he's weak to dying. Majin Buu. It does sound like Majin Buu, you are right. How's the idea so far? It is great. Just gotta trudge through the uh, worst dungeon in the game, then it's all uphill from here. I'm very excited for DDS2 as well, because DDS2 is just a banger in general. Like, it really steps this game up. Yeah, very familiar looking painting. No, it is, it is what you think. Oh, you know what it's time for. Oh, you get something for doing this. There they are. Oh, the crit? The normal attack crit, huh? Nice to see. Shit, taunted. They're probably not going to do many physicals anyways. Oh, he absorbs that? I thought it was just a void. Oh, but he does have Dekunda. At least they have their, their normal sound effects here. Instead of some stock sound effects and all that. Alright, gotta make the most of this. He do be decundering though. Dead. Fire repel. Actually, no. Fire repel would have been bad because it would have made uh, me heal him. Not a lot of blizzard damage here. Okay, he targeted the wrong person. We're good. Miss. Listen to me. <laughs> 
bro. He's really letting me know. Yeah, he ho brothers coming through. I would throw up a fire repel shield, but it's just gonna heal him because he's a. Uh, he absorbs that shit. He's probably dead now. There we go. I need to get Bufala soon for surf. Jack cell. Funny thing about this item, um, all cells sell for higher if you sell them at uh, full solar uh, full solar noise, but the jack cell sells for the most at uh, minimum solar noise. Alright, part two of this fucking dungeon. Another puzzle. skills in this game just null. Yeah, there are, um, it's tiered. You start off with null, and then you get, um, reflect, and then absorb. That demon innately had an absorb, so if I reflected the fire back at him, it would heal him. I could have used an item. I don't have it. Actually, no, I don't have a, um, there are items that wall off, but I, I didn't have a firewall. Do I have any mantras I could get? The runes, at least. Yo, what's up, Saluna? We are playing Pog Game. This would be really good. Rekunda is fucking good. So is Helmanon. How's this game feel in Emilia? It's good. The menus are responsive because this game is super responsive in general. And because it's a turn-based game, I don't really have to worry about input lag overall. Like I do in like Cage 2 or something. Let's get hidden. Yeah, DDS is great. Viewership for this has been great as well, which is like more the more important thing. Because I know this game is good as fuck. I done none. We done know. Dodging obstacles. I think this is the easy one. And there's one more after this. One more fucking puzzle. Yeah, fucking DMZ3. Looking ass. What is this? Cage 2 chest? Oh, I don't even have the key. Can I even get encounters in this room? Bro. Okay. Yeah, the real juice of this stream playthrough has been just like, th there's been a lot of interest in it. Like I've gotten way better viewership for this shit than I thought I would. Which is good, I'm glad. Yeah, that one's easy, the other one's a bit harder. Yeah, I've been I've been hyping up this game and uh, getting all the SMT sleeper agents on Twitter to come through as well, so. Who would have known that Cage fans like JRPGs?
Can't lock a chest. Oh, fuck. I thought I needed a key for that. I'll go back for it. Who would have thought it? It's because of your first job. Hey, do what you gotta do. Congratulations on the job. I remember when I got my first job, I was playing this game. Not at work, of course, but, you know, around the time. So I get a lot of nostalgia in that sense. Yeah, bag boy sham. I was a bagger at a at a uh, Chicago and uh, grocery store chain that um, hires both cashiers and baggers for the checkout lanes. Yeah, that photo, that photo of me in the shish emote is literally me in my uniform. I remember I was sitting on break. It, it came from a, a Snapchat video where I was sitting on break, and there was a there's a fucking store alarm blaring in my ear during my break. Yeah. I worked there for two months, and then I got a YouTube channel, and then I put in a one week, uh, one week notification, and I was out of there. All right. Big room. There's a lot going on in here. Probably has to get to this one. Yeah, there's a lot going on here. Oh, I see. I thought that would turn in. That's actually bullshit. Look at that. That does not make any sense. This this is literally facing that way. Okay, dude. Bro, memento numero dos. Easy. Let's get these chests. Make sure to go back for that other room. That had one of these. Soma. That's actually a big. Magic noise. I'll take that. God, that sound effect for healing in this game is so over the top. Listen to that. I'm going to give this Argyle, actually. God, it's like straight out of the 90s or something. Focus charge sound effect, yeah, honestly. This game has very striking sound effects in the UI. Big fan, like, listen to this shit. Can't beat it. S tier UI sounds in this game. There's a cell. That's good. It sells for a lot. How ironic. Revival gem. Nostalgia for a game you never played, yeah. I thought they were weak for that, whoops. Damn. That's the opposite of being weak. Okay, well. Why is it slow on my game, dude? 
Oh, it slows down my OBS as well. I'm gonna have to fix that. Do I have? I don't have my Zio. Where's my Zio? Yeah, there it is. Oh, I do have Zianga. Forgot about that. Okay. Yeah, Genie Jafar coming through. Literal genies. Feed Frenzy is really good. It's a random targeting uh, hunt AoE. So if I have like a group of three uh, frightened, I could potentially get all three or two at least. Venom Fang, better than Vile Blade. Because of uh, I don't have any mantras on surf right now. Secunda these nuts. Save. Genie looks at Argilla down there before. Booba ing. Oh, yeah, true. To their eyes. Audio's off key again. I need to teach you how to. Um, if, you, if you have FFZ, you can turn that shit off. There's a way to do it. But yeah, all you gotta do is refresh. It's really a really, really bad Twitch feature. Kaja would be great. Could try that an hour ago. What was the name of the setting that you did exactly? Because you can get FFZ and then you have to set something up specifically. So you might not have done that. Time for hell. Once the princess was captured, it wasn't long before the princess came to the tower. They both meant to rescue the imprisoned damsel. However, the evil prince, in his hatred of the good prince, challenged him to a duel that he might never reach the princess. There, in front of the princess, the two men faced each other, and the duel began. Okay, so download Frank or Phase Z, and then let me open up the page just so I can uh, get a reference for where you might need to go. How come I only have 720p as my max quality setting? I'm streaming at 1080p right now. I'm a Twitch partner. They've been fucking me over lately. Okay, click on the cog next to chat. Uh... Oh no, where's the Franker Face Z Control Center? It's at the top right of the screen, next to your profile picture in Twitch. And then there's the box that says Search Settings, Find, um... Okay, yeah. Let me, like, get this on a screenshot. I feel like this is a very frequent, um... Frequently asked question of how to fix this shit. draw on here, like a circle. Okay.
Look at this setting. This is the setting for the Franker VC control. Sorry, you're doing this. You made no problem. I, uh, I've been meaning to do this for a while because I always get questions about this. Get Franker Face Z, open up the control center, type in player in the search box, and then um, click this option. Allow player to speed up to reduce delay. It causes audio distortion. This shit's hella annoying. Don't worry, I get this question like at least once a stream, and I've always wanted to like make this image. Let me upload it somewhere so I can make a command for it. Is this something you have to download? Yeah, it's a Twitch extension. There's a lot of benefits to getting FFZ. A lot of people have emotes that are exclusive to people who have the extension. Okay. There we go. Okay, let's get back to it. Twinkle Bell is back. This is a fucked up puzzle where we have to move around this fucking trolley thing. This room in particular gives us the Nocturne camera. God, this is a nightmare. We have to move the fucking prince over there. To see what happens when we move shit around, maybe just brute force it. Yeah, FFZ is an extension that, um, F if you're if you're looking to improve your Twitch, you get FFZ and then get uh, BTTV. It's called Better Twitch TV. Um, people, a lot of people have emotes on their channel that are only visible if you have those extensions. So you'll get a bunch better Twitch experience for having both of those. Yeah, this dungeon song changes as you progress. It adds more layers onto it. I forget what this guy's weak to. Choo choo loin. Oh my god. Oh, he shields death. Oh my god. Oh my god, that could have killed us. Yeah, it's weird seeing a guy that early. Thank you, Saluna. Yeah, it's a really good demon design. There they are again. Alright, let's get some intel on Saris bodies. Weak to fire. Okay, that's exactly what I thought. Suck under these nuts. <laughs> buffing speed or debuffing speed is a good play against uh, AoE stuff. Especially in Nocturne when you have four party members instead of just three. Let's get the intel on this guy as well. He's dangerous. Pamelin. No, Chuchelin. Weak poison nerve. I don't have any of those. I did find out something last time I played this game, though, that um, enemies that are weak against ailments will get hit by physical um, ailment skills more consistently. 
Hey, so didn't get poison that time though, so I, was, I guess I'm wrong. Maybe just more often. Sword and Shield during Shams stream. Yeah, I, I don't care for Pokemon and all the all the copium that people have been throwing at the um, defending the mainline games for having bad presentation despite being like the richest richest fan base. You'd think with all that Pokemon franchise money, you could uh a better looking game. I don't know. Crazy idea. Where the hell did copium come from as a term? Combination of the word cope and opium. I don't know why it got popular though. It's very funny though. It's kind of like Makakaja and Rakakaja and Tsukakaja being I do the game's magic stat term. Huh? No, the only... I think the only reason why um, Tsukaja is good against AOE skills is because um, the more en the more people that are getting hit by a skill, the higher chance that somebody can dodge it. So like, compared to a single target, if you throw a move out against four people, they're gonna have a higher chance of dodging it. At least one person dodging it compared to um, one. Yeah, you know, if you have four party members, one person can dodge that way more likely than if it's just one person getting hit by one move. DDS using magic set to determine magic resistance and ability to dodge magic attacks. Yeah, I'm just talking in general, of, like in general AOE stuff, whether it's a Fizz or like a fucking Megiddo or something. I don't think buffing magic increases your resistance though. I'm pretty sure it's just damage. I could be very wrong about that. It does? Okay, that's good to know. I think this is the room that we can get the yellow key from if we backtrack to this dungeon. Just very slightly, yeah. It's probably just a, like a like a byproduct of how the game works. This guy's weak to ailments. I don't have any of that. Just gotta do raw damage. See that? That's with a Torundo, dude. This guy hits hard. I really need to start getting some ailment skills to deal with people like this. Please dodge. Can't eat a wasp, I'd, uh, I'd take them somewhere. The risk reward isn't in your favor to do nothing. See ya. Oh god, it's time for our Rate on that move is ridiculous. Good thing I poisoned him, or else he could have wiped the party there. Sheesh. Mamudo.
pretty sure Mount Mudo has a lower odds than standard Mudo, right? Enemies that drop stat boosts are in different locations in this game. Oh yeah, like um, the Titania tunnel, right? So I'm changed Heat's mantra. Yeah, I, I'm just not doing much with him right now. I don't mind him not having anything. I just don't want to spend the money. I don't have a lot of money right now, or else I would. I'm not going to get much use out of him the rest of the playthrough because I have a physical surf. Alright, we got to figure out what the fuck we're doing in this room. I forget how to access the uh, the buttons for those. I think I have to get up there and press that button. I think I went up there earlier, I think I just didn't press the button. Shit. What? This this is probably the easier version of this puzzle. Because there's a second one. So I probably only have to do that. Yeah, it's like a fucking roller coaster tycoon room. Nightmare room. Yeah, this man just does quick turns. He's fast. He doesn't get fucking thrown off the roller coaster either. He's just moving. I've been going down this way. I don't think I've gone off this side then. I think I was wrong. I thought he blocks that. No, she doesn't even block that. Very convenient to have a physical surf hybrid. Normally, what I would do is I'd put it all into one or the other, but in this game, at least just for DDS 1, I'm gonna balance it out. DDS2 though, I'm full selling that fucking stat. DDS2 is a uh, DDS2 hard mode is quite the thing. Cat jam. Just rush him down with uh, big damage. I don't have many options against this guy. You can see the stat differential on the magic stat already. Those two moves should be doing around the same because they're both uh, boosted level 2 magic. You Narokumi for the Xbox 360. That's one long cat. Bam. This guy's a weak to thunder. See ya, monkey. I should put on um, at least feed frenzy so that when they're like this, I can just use that for damage. At least I can wipe them with that move. Just capitalize on my big strength stat. Feed Frenzy over Death Spray. Okay, we gotta get him onto the orange rail now. Or whatever's connected to it. Okay, this is a straight shot up. This one's not too hard. Yeah, Death Spray wasn't doing a whole lot. The multi-hit can be nice sometimes, but I guess it doesn't scale as well as strength. I 
I'd rather do a feed frenzy when there are multiple uh, frightened enemies. Feed frenzy for the Wii. It's like a fish game. Bro, I'm one frame away from the door. I know these guys are weak to Mudo for sure. Unfortunate miss. Big damage. 81 off of a normal hit. That's nice to see. Didn't somebody learn something? Oh, it was her. Not Gail. Let's not, uh, put all the force repels on Gail. Because that would make it so that our Gail can't do a gun combo. If she doesn't have the, uh, the repel shield needed. Opens up something for Gale. Uh, oh, death. I'm not really getting hit by a lot of death type enemies. I just do an easy Mazan. Take off that quick escape. Not necessary right now. There we go. That's a good setup. All right, final layer. Does anybody know how I can email my dedicated Twitch guy as a partner? I need to talk to somebody about my lack of quality options. This is like Pokemon where you run in a circle over and over again and you'll get an encounter. Oh yeah. Except every single, 99% of every place is uh, tall grass. Commandant plus Mudun plus Kaja buff is Mekidola. Oh nice. That's pretty uh, sensible. It's a lot for one almighty skill though. They buff the shit out of uh, combo skills in DDS2. The requirements are much more lenient the good stuff. Yeah, I don't think she can get anything right now. I'm just going to focus on getting money. I should get, um, I should start getting earth skills for Argilla, honestly. Oh yeah, this is, she's had this since the start of the game, I just never mastered it. That's like her starter mantra. Yeah, I'm just gonna focus on getting money for now. I don't have a lot of money and everything's about to start getting very expensive.
think there's one more fucking trolley room and then I'm out of here. Yeah. Got the Windows 98 startup sound in the song now. through this nightmare room. Cannot proceed. It's too dark. What do you mean? Oh yeah. It's a light puzzle and a fucking trolley puzzle. As another turn-based RPG demands a lot, have you ever taken like a Darkest Dungeon? I think I've heard of it, but I otherwise no. I think I've heard of the name, but nothing more. Trolley light puzzle, dude, this is a nightmare. Good thing about streaming an RPG that literally nobody has played like this game is that nobody can backseat. That is one advantage. Even if they wanted to. To get to something, I can turn that. I just hope I like accidentally stumble upon the right answer and just get out of here. Sector E type of beat. I I don't know what's so fucked up about Sector E. I haven't, I don't think I plan on playing Strange Journey anytime soon. I definitely have heard horror stories though. What does Twinker Bell have to say? Randomized dungeon crawler XCOM style character perma death and stress sanding mechanic. That sounds pretty nutty. That's pretty neat. Let's go back up. Is there a secret path behind this as well? Carrying your corpse in the darkness where light cannot reach. That does not help me. Let's see where this takes me. Very good visually, oh nice. Are reflected into. I forgot. I think I have to get it up here, yeah. I have to make it hit that thing, maybe? I don't know. Let's just see where this takes me. Fuck it all. We're going in. there. I'm 
pretty sure I have to shine on there and then I can know that becomes a door. I just don't remember how to get it all the way up there again. I do this better. I have yet to play that game, actually. I am very curious. I do know that that game has a lot of dungeon puzzles in it, though. Play Royal? Oh, yeah. No, I'm, I plan on it. I know the, uh, the strats. Let me see what I can do with that over there. Oh, I see. Okay. Let me put that other one back, and I should get something out of this. Yeah, no, I didn't plan on playing OG. It doesn't seem like there's any benefit to that when there's just a newer version. Final Mix. Oh, easy. I didn't see the- okay, I didn't- I didn't realize that there were upper reflectors, that makes sense. Thank fucking Christ, we're out of here. I got the target switch. I tried to press it. Oh, it doesn't do an AoE. Okay, just use. I forgot what they were weak to. Save though, I don't want to lose any of that fucking progress. For sure. Let's see, I'm going down the Thunder Lane. Oh, you know what I should have done? I should have bought, um, ice stuff for Surf. I'll do that next time. Alright, I'll be back. I'm going to the bathroom, and then we will, uh, do the final boss of this dungeon.
right, let's do this. Level 24 is already. again with that. Listen to them. Listen to me. It's funny how a lot of nocturne lines are just kind of like partial gibberish English for the demons. They sound like they're saying something half the time. It's weird. Ooh, the crit. Good. door so I'm gonna set up for it. I think I'm like for the most part pretty well set up already. Just definitely take that off. Yeah definitely a long dungeon but thankfully we are at the end. guessing here, but I don't have much to work with anyways. Yeah, this should be fine. Let's just heal up on the MP. I don't have much to work with there either. Ding dong. Okay, here's an actual save point. came all this way so that I could devour you. Come on, let's hear you sing. And if you do a good job, I'll bring you along to Nirvana. <laughs> Who'd want to go with you? <laughs> oh, you don't like me. Well, if you're not going to cooperate, then... Maybe I'll snap your little neck right now. Get your grubby hands off her! I'll tear you apart, you fat freak! <laughs> All right, come and get a piece of me.
Ich. Here's a little something for last time. You? If you want the girl back, then kill your leader. What? Maybe we'll reward you and your sweetheart with a trip to Nirvana. Mick doesn't give a damn about her, and neither do I. Once we're there, she's all yours. And listen carefully. Do as I say, and it'll be worth your Yo, while. Knife slapping, sheesh. No! You can't trust that traitor. I knew this was coming. Now we'll know for sure who's superior. Heat! Stop! Don't move, maggots! There is no alternative. Defeat him, Surf. Now the cutscene themes are such bangers in this game. Cannot. No, you don't. I don't think so, girly. What the? My ears! Let go of me. Got EMP coming through. Sarah! Catch now, just don't drop her. I really thought you were better than this, Mick. <laughs> Gwen Stacy, huh? that's what? rough. I'm going to join the brutes. It's been my plan all along. I knew it. Don't move, moron, or I'll crush her skull. The only man that's allowed to identify is an attack helicopter. Because he literally is. Easy does it. See you all. Out of here. Where are you going? <laughs> Surf, what was it he'd said he'd do back there? Yep. We'll tear you apart, you fat freak. Uh, 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 
We do a little trolling. That'd be a cool caption for that. <laughs> That'd be funny. This is two targets actually. This boss. I think they're weak against force. The top one definitely is. Got this fucking suck mechanic. His head is a rant sona, true. I was able to do enough damage to him on that one turn with that one move alone. I was able to stop that. A little worried about his damage output because I taunted him. I do have Dikaja though. Yeah, let's actually throw that right now. Hog move. Banger theme coming through. A vertical line? I didn't see it on my screen, maybe it was on OBS. Uh, I need MP for Surf. Might as well deal with that now before I run out. Actually, no, I don't have. Uh, I'll have to use a great shocker later on in this fight. Uh, Secunda these nuts. I forgot what the uh, the body's weak to fire. It's so funny when you kill the body first. The the head just stands there. In fact, I'm actually gonna do that. I'm gonna kill the body first specifically so I can show that off. That's an earth move. I need to block that. Earth, unfortunately, so I'm just gonna debuff speed and hope go for the dodges. There's a dodge, yeah, hell yeah. Kinda of these nuts. Yeah, buffing speed is really good. You get shitloads of dodges without needing to buff the agility stat at all. do enough damage you force to you know can you swap party members mid battle yeah you can actually it's just I don't think you can do it when they get like sucked in like that it's just not worth doing because the buffs that you apply to your current party members don't apply to uh, party members in stock so it's very often just not in your favor
Yeah, here we go with the fucking standing. <laughs> Look at that thing. It's it's funnier when he's not in his uh, lower health animation. And there's the kill. Yeah, I had such a good setup for that fight. Holy shit. Now we got some uh, some ailment skills finally. I oh, got two level ups. Holy shit! Yeah, the death animations are pretty good as well. Here you go, brother. Well, it looks like that got away. We will meet him again. He is strong. He would make a better ally than Cielo. Oh, come on! I totally saved Sarah back there! Are you joking? That makes me sick. Yeah, what she said! What is... joking? As far as I know, it means you aren't serious. I do not comprehend. Banger alert. Sir. Yeah, he don't understand self-control. Well, at least I everyone's all right now. I'm sorry. I... I came here to help. But I've only created problems. There really... isn't anywhere I belong. Hey, why you say that, Sarah? You've got a place to stay. I well, do not I mean, comprehend. We're... you know... We're comrades, am I right? Yeah, that's it. Comrades? That's right. I do not comprehend. Oh, hush. That's enough from you. Hey, say something, Surf. Here's what that fucking boss looks like when it's like standing on its own. Literally just bra moment. The fluoride stare. Oh yeah, this next this next dungeon is a banger. It makes up for this dungeon's lack of fucking good music. Here, before we do anything though, let's uh regroup for some items. chat. I was gonna retweet my promotion tweet for the stream. Get yeah, back to Minnesota. Time to play some billiards. noise. Uh, what is my noise at? My noise meter. I hope it's on the decline so I can get the minimum noise to sell that jack cell at a higher price. It's not. I'll just sell that to a... It doesn't tell you if the moon phase is on its way up or down. That's one thing that could be better.
penis music. Stuns is crazy. Yeah, that should be good. Okay. Hey, what's up, Jordan? The darkness. Welcome to the stream. We are playing Pog Game. What does CLO start off with? Zayunga, Drain Boost, and these are the, thing the things that I have on Gale right now. And a bunch of things I unlocked for Surf. Yes, he always gonna be my ailment guy because he's weak to ailments, so it's good to get him on the uh, the ailment shield path. Day, I need to stream the fucking Minnesota Fats pool, like the actual pool game that that's from. That'd be a fun stream for the meme. Is he actually like genuinely good? Alright, I'm going in. Oh, I just figured out a way to make the chat display better. Hold up. We have to destroy this ship. We will spread a rumor that you are hidden here. To get the attention of Bat and the Brutes. Needless to say, this is a trap. They show up expecting to find Sarah and boom. There we go. Now the chat display is more compact. Come on, why don't we try somewhere else, huh? Guys? The structure's material and design make this environment highly combustible. Is it really that simple? Up there in I the mean, Halo streams? The Maybe soon. Sarah's not here. Maybe we'll do another Sarah one soon. Be here. Huh? huh?
Behold. Okay. This seriously won't work. Why is that? Obviously, Sarah isn't this tall. Her hair is way different, and her arms ain't that thick. Oh! Well, excuse me. They only need to be deceived from a distance. Boss! The brutes are here! <sighs> Already? Sarah and Heat. They left for our new headquarters a few minutes ago. I hope they weren't spotted. They moved faster than I expected. We must hurry. If we do not, they will devour us. Okay, okay. Let's do this then. Let's go! Remain here and intercept Bat. He is sure to enter through the windows. Understood. Let us go. We will set traps for them throughout the ship. Yeah, this is the closest this gets to a fucking hot springs, I guess. Washed up cruise ship. This is a cool dungeon. The music's really good. I can smell that Sarah girl scent in the Young air. Young Waka, true. The woman's there too. There's no mistake. Varen. Don't ever call me by that name. I am a colonel. Colonel Beck. The Dark Souls of Hot Springs. That's right. And I even know who you really are, Angel. Now get me the hell out of here. Very interesting. If you truly are the Colonel, you would know that is not possible. After all, it was you who requested this world be locked, was it not? You must open the door on your own. Don't give me that Nirvana crap! How dare you speak to me and- On that day, everything changed. Now, each individual shall be judged by his karma. Even so, I pity those like you. I'm beginning Sheesh. to understand how this works. The crumb. Allow me to help you. What does he know that we don't? The bell shall sound, awakening the sleeping one, Seraphita. How long will your eyes remain shut? Bring me that little punk and the cyber shaman. No matter what it takes, you won't get another chance. Yes, sir. So now we have CO in the party. And nothing but. What, does he have a mantra right now? Let's get him something else. Actually, no, I don't think I'm gonna get him anything. Everything down here is super expensive. Maybe I'll just get him... Let's get him Earth Magic just so he can... Abuse a weakness while he's in the party here. Save up for, um... This. Yeah, Beck's got a good voice actor. I don't know who he is, though. I don't know if I've heard him anywhere. Besides this game. The stairs are collapsed. How could you possibly want to get down there? 
Yeah, this game is just goaded. Especially for being the first, like, fully voice acted Atlas game. Or at least a SMT game. They did a good job with the cast. Bob Pattenbrook? Yeah, I definitely haven't heard of him. Yeah, this is a straight shot. We don't have to deal with any encounters, thankfully. What would I do without you? Was it the Black Knight in Scooby-Doo 2? I actually know who you're referring to when you say that. I have indeed seen that movie. You're talking about the live-action one, right? Thank you, Gail. What would I do without you? Yeah, Surf is, uh, Surf's battle quotes are fucking Yuri Lowenthal. Won't be hearing much of them, though. At least not for a while. Attack mirrors. Oh yeah, those are good. Those are hard to come by this early on. Yeah, let me mess with the uh, the layout real quick. Get enough space for one more message in there. Let me just see how this all looks. Oh, whoops. Wrong monitor. Yeah, that's good. For a, uh, for a makeshift chat display, this actually worked out really well. Just fucking, like, monitor capturing the monitor with OBS on it and then color keying it. I don't know why the hell Streamlabs was just broken today. Oh, these guys are weak to fire. It's all over for them. They come to... See ya. A lot of money for that one. Banger alert. This theme goes so hard. They void fizz? Wow, that's fucked up. Oh, the snakes reflect thunder. I have no idea what these guys are weak to at all. Spyglass. Rip Cielo. Let's get the intel. 
force expel. Okay. Yes, the OO slumped. Let me void first, don't auto. God damn it. These guys do not look like they void fizz at all. Oh well. At least you can get hit by this. Beep. At least he starts out with Meteor. So he's a good healer. We have the advantage. Proceed. Does anybody have Hama here? No, I don't. Good thing he's weak to being killed. I wonder if they're weak to any ailments, so let me check. Spell, Charm, and Panic, okay. Wait, doesn't CO have a, uh, a Hama, or did I take that off of him? I took it off of him, okay. Sweet. Yeah, the soundtrack in this game is go What's up, Nightmare DJ? Let's give, um, Surf Hama. I don't need, uh, Taunt anymore because I have Tarred Kaja. I don't need to make everybody strong as fuck. Just to get more damage out. Did not say weakness to fire. If it did, I missed it. Or didn't even realize. See you later, Damski. It did? Okay, I'm done. Devour skill right now. <laughs> Mamudo. Okay, full miss. Yeah, I'm gonna save up for this and then just get this. So I'm just gonna go for a quick killing everything in this dungeon. Wait till real. What's up, Cup Gold? Is SMT as hard as people make it out to be? Not really. It has a reputation for a reason, but if you know what you're doing, or at least um, you use buffs, it becomes a lot more manageable once you like actually go through the process of learning how this game works. This game is a lot more reasonable as well. Like this game in particular, Digital Double Saga. What's that gonna do in this menu? Oh yeah, I was gonna look for combos. My Zanmo would be nice. Oh yeah, nobody else has either of these skills. Only uh, Argilla had Zanma. I can't do that combo. I still have Dekunda and Dekaja, it's nice to have. That should be good. Yeah, super bosses are definitely uh, built different, but that's because they're super bosses. Yeah, buffs being really, really good in these games are what sets it apart from other turn based games.
Oh. And what would I do without you, Gail? Okay, you asked for it. God, it's a shame I don't have, um... Actually, no, here's the strat for AoE, uh, force skills. I only hit two people, come on now. Oh my god, the frame rate. That only happens when I stream. I'll have to adjust my stream settings to make them less CPU dependent. No, they, they all void Fizz. What are you doing? What am I thinking? Use an item. I don't have any uh, force bombs. That's so unfortunate. God damn it. Why does that sound like somebody's snoring? Very good question. I don't know. These guys are built different. They're gonna hit one of these eventually. Well, somebody's gonna die from this. Yeah, there, there goes Gale. Sheesh, this is a nightmare encounter. Yeah, I'm taking the L. Okay. If I had an AoE win skill, that would have been free. But I only have random targeting ones and Gale's gunshot, which did not hit near as many enemies as I hoped it would have. Where does this go? Where the hell am I supposed to go if it's not this way? What the hell? TF2? Probably never. No, I think. At least I never got into it. Or never even tried it. I respect it, though. I respect all Quake Engine games. Later. Skull. Oh, they're just extra doors here. I didn't see these. I don't know how. Okay, you ask for it. Are these guys too weak, weak to anything other than force? Let's see. And expel. Okay, I could have like Muhammad everything in that previous encounter. That's good to know now. I need to put Feed Frenzy on. Just so, so I get like a multi panic situation, I can uh, get the big damage off of it. See how it's dead, or Surf's dead. Oh, I guess it's not guaranteed death if you're cursed. That's new to me. Revive Gale. I can't. Nope. I could probably kill him at least with the fire. Just do raw damage. Nothing beats a big damage fire spell.
Didn't see those doors. Last time Gale interrupted you, said we can't use the elevator. Oh, yeah. Or at least it wasn't too far of a walk back. Ouch. No, I haven't played Mario RPG. I've heard it's good, though. A lot of money for just one enemy. Put on Feed Frenzy. Honestly, just put it over Venom Fang just because there are so many enemies that avoid uh, Fizz here. Oh, it's these guys. These guys are all weak to Thunder. sound like rats when you kill them, even though they're fucking stingrays. Yeah, PSD of a uh, pre-matador farming to show up there. Sham Megami Tensei. Hell yeah. It's a Budzilla. Butterzilla. Yeah, level 18 you zoom me. Yuzumi is so good in that fight. These guys are weak to force, right? I think I remember. Oh, that is the opposite of being weak to force, okay. I don't know why I thought that. It's definitely Thunder, because we have CL in the party. Oh, I guess it's fire. I have no idea what they're weak to then. Yeah, enemies with fitting sounds for once. True. What could they possibly be weak to? Oh, it's Earth. Okay. I've barely been using Earth skills this playthrough. Really? Probably took like no damage from that anyways. Kill him. Yeah, Earth is easy to forget about because it's in like no other game except for this one. All right, all the Thunder enemies are gonna get destroyed in here. Games where Force looks like Earth. Any Cage 3 mods that intrigue you? Uh, not really. I haven't been checking lately though. I'm more intrigued by the stuff that's been popping up for like Cage 1 and Cage 2. Cage 1 in particular, all the, um, the randomizer stuff. There was a mod that came out recently that made it so that uh, the 30% chance finishers like Zantetsuke and Gravity Break and Stun Impact now come out 100% of the time. So next time I do Cage One Randomizer, I'll be able to do like consistent Zantetsukens if I get that ability. Okay, you asked for it. Oh, 
God damn it, see all. He's supposed to be the evasive one. I think I've got huge strength set for stuff like that. Didn't even have a mantra literally just for killing them. Just avoid fizz but not hunt. I said this already, didn't I? Yeah. Just gotta go around now. Combo skills are so fucking good, like this. If I had a mantra right now, the surf would be juicing. But they're just using that for damage. Money's good though. We're getting a lot of good money in this dungeon. Complex is our 500 IQ game design. They should put back in SMT5. Hell yeah. What's up, Zendro? How's it hanging? Combo skills would be pretty hard to implement if you didn't make it so that um, in a game that has like demons, where you can't like really control much of their. Um... I feel like combos only really work if you have the set button. Who knows, maybe demons could have their own individual sets so that instead of permanently overriding skills, you'd get like a grid of skills that you could like swap in and out. That'd be cool. I'd like to see the set button like partially implemented into uh, an SMT game with demons in it. As you have several with human party members. That's cool. Why does that slow down my game when I have OBS open? I don't understand. Gotta look into that. The latest SMT game with demons? Um. I guess if you count the phone game, DX2. But if you're talking mainline, 4 Apocalypse would be the most recent. The chat display is working. Was 4A after SJ Redux? Uh, yeah, it was after. It's just I don't count remakes as like more recent. Alright, finally. This is a really, really good grid. Rocket Kaja and Sakaja are really good. Chill on Gale's stuff for now. Did they really not dub Strange Journey Redux? It's kind of ridiculous. I don't know why they would do that. Why would they not do that? That's crazy. What are they thinking? Mm -hmm. 
counter skills. Oh, sheesh. Oh, the crit. Unfortunate. Do I have a... This is kind of bad. Just heal. Okay, I could have just done that right away. Just making sure. Once the 3DS was on its way out, Atlas stopped dubbing. They should have started fucking making Switch games instead. I don't know why they've been sleeping on the Switch for so long. Seems like the perfect console for them. On that note, I really hope that um, SMT5 is on the PS4 and PC as well. I've yet to play Apocalypse, so I don't have any opinions about it. I played SMT4 recently, though. It was pretty decent. Too bad Sarah isn't here, sucker. Flying can't save your ass in here. There's no escaping this time. Why did you sell to not out? Your idiot friend, he'd do the same thing. Oh, but you'll never see him again. Not after I devour you. Janana was delicious. Batman. No, you bastard! <laughs> talking to these dude. Yeah, Kaneko is built different. He gets to draw stuff like that. I really like Kazuma Kaneko's like, humanoid demon designs like these guys. Okay, what are these fucking sheep weak to? Dynamic attack sheep. Earth and mute. Everything's weak to earth in here. I need to get an earth AoE. Gave that to me. How are they weak to earth but cast earth? That's so weird. Easy. Yeah, people. Praise, we will have high praise for the mechanics of SMT 4A. I, I wonder why. Maybe one day I'll figure out. Gonna do part two? What, of this game? Yeah, I'll be doing DDS too. Same encounter as before. Yeah, I gotta do something about these. Something about these sheep. This is a risky play, but I'm going for it. There we go. Worth. Is there a combo seal for uh, Montera? 
It's probably some random fucking spells slapped together. Let's just get a mute skill on, uh... Oh, we do have a mute skill. I think I've been using that on the sheep. Oh, well. How am Mudo worth it? How am I building Surf? Um, I'm doing like a... I should, I'm kind of behind on Blizzard skills. I keep forgetting to do that. Doing like a Strength Magic Hybrid. Right now I'm working on buff skills, but I need to get... Um, or not, not Blizzard, but I need to get more Fire skills. Actually, I'm not too far behind. Should be good. Yeah, I'm good. I'm going for like hunt skills and um, hunt skills buffs and fire. I'm not getting ready to do demi fiend. I I didn't yeah I, I would need to do a cycle two playthrough for that. So I'm not worrying about that. That's not a spoiler. No, everybody knows about that. That's not really a spoiler. It's. It, it must be unimaginably difficult to, like, go into that not knowing that that's who the boss is. I don't care. But yeah, no, you have to do a Cycle 2 playthrough for Demi Fiend for some weird reason. I don't know. Yeah, optional bosses are a fair game. I don't care. In fact, that was the very first thing I saw about this game, was the, uh, the Demi Fiend boss. I was like, oh, that, wow, that's cool. Oh my god, don't kill Gale. Okay. These guys are free. <laughs> Easy clap. Alright, we've placed a lot of bombs so far. I don't know how many more we have left, but we're getting there. There you sell. Bruh. Yeah, no, Mysterious Figure is a joke compared to Demi Fiend. Demi Fiend is a ridiculous 40 minute to an hour minute fucking boss fight. Hour minute, well. Wow. Whereas MF has some pretty reliable, not reliable, but like, you can easily chase him with uh, Thunder Surges and whatnot. And dodge roll spam. Yeah, cheesing Demi Fiend. Um, um, are you referring to the the null sleep strategy? How close am I to a restore point? I'm tempted to use that great shocker right now, but I don't know if it's a good play. Yeah, Demi Fiend is a battle of patience, and um, the biggest thing you have to get around is uh, his Gaia Rages. Because he, he literally just does a, an AoE move that wipes your party, and you need to use um, second chance strats. 
Except you only get second chance once per battle, so you have to know when he's gonna do a full, like, party wipe. Remove all your party members except for the person who has, um, indoor active. And then get everybody back into the party after that happens. Yeah, I need to use the fucking Great Chakra. I've got no resources right now. Whatever. I wish I had feed friends right now. I have no fucking health. I can't do it. Oh, they aren't low enough health. Whatever, I'll just kill him. Death March. Oh no. I, my life just flashed before my fucking eyes right there. Do you see how low CL's health is? That movie's a nightmare. I forgot all about that. That was so close to GG right there. Holy shit. I'm not gonna let those guys survive for that long going forward. Holy shit. That was insane. Yeah, CLO. I cannot believe he survived and I died. Yeah, I thought the whole party was wiped too. Cause that move it does a lot of fucking damage. It's, it's the last resort move, basically. Oh. Rip that great chakra, I could have just walked a bit for more forward. Oh well. Oh sheesh. Oh my god. Red Star Strat is the Oh that's Red Star? I thought Red Star was something else. I thought Red Star was just the, the basic term for when you loop uh, bosses into uh, Dekunda loops. Oh, it's a Dikanda loop, but she's out of MP. Okay. That makes sense. Yeah, just kill these guys. Yeah, human CL would absolutely say sheesh. Get behind on vitality. Get rid of the demon, waste their turn. With Dekaja, yeah. That's pretty wild. It's interesting that this game actually makes uh, enemies run out of MP. Not a lot of games do that, don't they? Hybrid build, oh yeah. Uh, DDS2, I'm definitely, definitely gonna be going for the fucking uh, full magic build. But in this game, this game's not that difficult to warrant that. So I'm just making Surf the uh, the hunter of the party. He's the guy who's gonna get AP divide and Atma boost. Really just going for more of a convenience build than anything else. Yo, 
we are gaming in here. You're absolutely right. What's up, Asa? Merry Edge and Gaming. How's it coming? It's good. It's been a very fun playthrough so far. Man, these guys fucking threw up a Thunder Resistance. I'm gonna have to wait this out. This probably won't kill. Are you thinking of DDS2? From the additional stat thing? That's not this game, that's the next one. Are these guys really weak to force? I don't know why they threw up a force resist shield there. I'm actually gonna do a vitality dump when it comes to that point. I've done a strength and magic dump for that, but it's not really worth boosting up strength. I thought that strength was what you need to boost for uh, reducing damage, but it's actually vitality. Feed Fren yeah, Feed Frenzy is a devour skill that has random targeting. But it's really helpful because like, even if it's just against a single target, it's always going to hit that one target. So it you can use it in favor of uh, just using the single target basic devour skill. Bro, what the fuck? Yeah, just kill him. I got him so close to getting that karma. I'm gonna go for one more encounter in front of this karma terminal and then I'll progress. The only time you don't get an encounter is when you actually want one in this fucking game, dude. Fuck's sake. One sheep. Devour him. Actually, no, why would I need to devour him? I'm like one point away. Just kill him outright. There we go. Now we have buffs. Really good buffs. I don't need these now, though. Need those for bosses, not for random encounters. Yeah, let's get a mantra first, actually. Before we save. for that. No, I'm going for the, uh, going all the way. Consume. Hellfang. Those are both really good skills. Zeodyne. It's very expensive. Consume. Because it's cheap, I guess I might as well give him Tarunda. CL doesn't really need anything. I'm not going to have him a lot, a lot longer. The buff skills are in the bottom section of the, the grid here. They're like, um... They're tucked away with the ailment and light dark skills in like this... These two lines right here, mostly. That's where they keep them. Buff called charge. 
the all buff. Oh yeah, it's called charge in this game, yeah. This is the first game that had it actually. It's a I think it's exclusively a combo skill. I don't know. At least I've only ever seen it as a combo skill. I know debilitate you can get normally, but that's normal. Bruh. Alright, here's what we're gonna do. Taunt. Alright, done. Oh, fuck. That's bad. This could be bad. Alright, we're good. Um... There we go. Oh, they're still alive. Shit. Let's do that again. Yeah, charge is only in DDS2. Oh, that sounds about right. I didn't think it was in this game, yeah. Hold off on talk about the final boss for now. Yeah, it's like the halfway point. I'm assuming these guys are all weak to fire. Uh, yeah, fire. So, just gonna literally just run them through real quick. Does this game not have a heal all party members with the most efficient skills button? No, this game doesn't, but DDS2 has it. DDS2 has a recover button, yeah. Oh shit. They must really go for that. Rips y'all. At least it wasn't working on a mantra or anything. Yeah, Gale's demon form is so cool. It's up to some guy named Todd. Death blow. All sorts of elements being thrown around. What is Gur weak to? Gun, electric expel. Oh, yeah, it's there. If I had really rushed it down, I could have had um, Marageon for Surf. If you do a magic build and like dump everything to magic, and you rush down the fire skills for Surf, you could just like literally. Uh, solo this entire place with surf spamming fire Strats I'm doing are pretty heavy on MP. MP intensive, but it's getting me a lot of money because I'm killing everything within a couple turns, which is good for money gain. Feed frenzy. Keep. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah. Hope I get a uh, heal point soon here in a second. Because I really need some MP and I don't have items for it. Magic noise, so now I've got some magic for Surf. That's all I need. Oh yeah, here we go. Thank fuck. Alright, so the plan is, we're gonna finish this dungeon and then that'll be good for today. And we're close. It's nice that it looks like I can like finish out three dungeons within five hours, like almost consistently. Five dun the final dungeon is basically five. Yeah. That is quite the dungeon, isn't it? I think I'm backtracking. Did I place all the bombs? I think I did. Still, two left. Oh, fuck. Alright, let's take a gander here. I'm assuming that the red exclamation points are places I've already marked. Alright, one, two, three, four, five, six. There's none on seven or eight. Yeah, that sounds about right. Oh, let's do some quick escape strats. I've done enough fighting in this place. Put Gale in a uh, position number one so I don't have to pass to his turn to activate Quick Escape. Because I think Quick Escape only procs if you uh, use it on the party member that has it on their turn. It's interesting. I don't know why it would, it would be like that, but it do. Oh yeah, I didn't even go down here. Shit. This is an easy one, I'll kill these guys real fast. Get him out of here. That's a lot of money, that was 13k for killing those guys in like, three turns. How much money do I have? Almost 100k, nice. Gil can get Zeo done pretty soon here, that's what I spend that on. Off, man. Wait till real. Why is that slow down my game, dude? He's just confused. Please don't throw all my money. Okay. He used up a turn doing that. Oh, they are terrified, aren't they? Dead. Yeah, stomach aches are a weird mechanic. Hell yeah. Now we've got Consume and Hell Fang. These are both really good skills. Now I just need to get Power Charge and I can literally one-shot eat everything. And AP Divide. Really good. I don't really use... I don't... 
go out of my way to put on iron stomach just because in the grand scheme of things stomach aches are kind of rare I feel best SMT game to get into the series I like to say that this game is the best one because it's basically nocturne gameplay but like more forgiving more open-ended but nocturne is a really good one to get into as well especially with it coming out on PS4 switch and PC at the end of the month SMT4 is also a good one you get into if you got a 3DS. No dice. Yeah, the early game of SMT4 is, uh... And by early game, I mean literally just the first dungeon is, like, dog shit difficult just because you have no tools to deal with. Dark Souls and Persona. It's true, actually. Yeah, featuring Dante sticker. True. Uh, yeah, just kill him. Bold of you to get afraid. Oh, not enough press turns. A crit and a dodge, and another dodge. Featuring Raidu. Very true. Alright, where the fuck is this bomb that I need to plant? Somewhere around here. Do I even have a mantra for Surf right now? Or am I just, like, eating things and not gaining anything? Genuinely, I've not been paying attention. I don't even have anything, what am I doing? I mean, I guess it's good for the damage anyways, but yeah, we gotta get a, uh... Gotta get a mantra. Where the fuck is this bomb, dude? Oh, there's an item in here. I almost didn't see it. Quick escape. Survivor. Yeah, I don't know much about Double Survivor. I think I'm missing something. Oh, that's the reason why I didn't go over there, because of the broken door. God damn it. Should have figured that there's a reason why I didn't go there. Cat Jam. Yeah, this whole place is a cat jam. Are there randomizers for DDS1 too? No, nope, but there's a randomizer for Nocturne. I don't know if they're still developing it, but there's one in the works. I haven't checked up on it in a while though. Quick escape. It's a really good skill. Uh, 
Uh, let's check this other half of the, the floor. There's gotta be something I'm missing. Oh, is it enemy randomizer? I guess it makes sense, because it also randomizes the demons that you can get. Dante 2? Jesus Christ. That'd be insane. Alright. I don't know why they made this whole bottom section when they put nothing down here. I know where to go. Can we escape out of there? Yeah, we got pretty big there. Yeah, definitely didn't go down this side. Sheesh. Yeah, Mothman and a cell item. Just items, I guess. Yeah, I have no idea what Jim Reaper's gonna do for... If he's gonna get, ever get back to DDS2. He probably will eventually, it's just, uh... He's definitely taking his time. Quick escape. Yeah, it's just a matter of time, honestly. They're Tron shot. Where the hell do I plant this thing, dude? I've gone everywhere on this floor. One in the seventh and the eighth, and I have not set. I'm very confused. Bottom hallway. See, I'm pretty sure the reason why I didn't, uh, I didn't go there is because it was a, like, a broken door or something that you can't go through, but that's literally my only point in progression right now, so I might as well just go for it. Shouldn't take too long anyways, as long as I get my quick escapes. I definitely feel like I'm about to get trolled in a second here when I take all the time to go all the way down there and it just be a door I can't go through. Oh my fucking god. What are the odds of that happening? Uh, get him out of here. Sheesh, that was a triple crit. You don't see that very often. It's gotta be in here. Because you only plant the bombs in these metal corridors. That didn't work.
Oh my god, why did I not go through that door? I have not played Strange Journey, though. I don't know if I ever will. Just because the game doesn't have turn-based combat. But who knows, maybe I'll warm up to uh, classic-style combat after I play... Um, I plan on playing Soul Hackers. I can't believe I didn't go down that one hallway. I wrote it off because the last time I hunted down a... Uh, Last time I hunted down an unexplored corridor, it was just a broken door. Oh my god. What do you get for hitting weaknesses in Strange Journey? Extra damage, or do you get something else? Follow-ups? What does that mean? Demon co-ops? You do a combo attack with anyone in your party of the same alignment. Oh. Weird. I don't think I've ever played an SMT game that has a big influence on uh, demon alignment. Seed. Oh, I walked straight past the- oh my god. I walked straight past the, uh... The way up. Yeah, Strange Journey looks, um, more trouble than it's worth. IMO, just because I'm... A lot of what has gotten me into SMT is games like Nocturne and DDS are having, like, excellent presentation, uh, really satisfying combat, because it's in 3D. Oh, this is the ninth floor, isn't it? Okay. Let's go on to the seventh. Can you go on to the seventh via the elevator? No, only the eighth. Okay. Well, at least I was quick. Where are the stairs down? Oh, I was I was right to go down. God damn it. I'm wasting time by running around. The grip. For some reason I thought I was on the seventh floor, not the eighth, and I just genuinely did not look to see what floor I was on. Even though it's always in the top right corner of the screen at all times. Yeah, this is not very far trek. Okay, down the stairs. I see where this could be. I have not explored a lot of this floor, have I? Yeah, here we go. Wait a minute. Where am I? Oh yeah, I see. I see why I didn't go down there. It didn't look like it was an actual door, from the map, at least. Yeah, here we go, finally. Don't know how I missed those for so long, but at last we've done it.
That's well. Okay, no crits. Why do I think that that was a weakness? That was not the weakness. Will help a ship to kill a guy. It, it's more so you're killing a large portion of their troops. But yeah. Helfing. Very cool. Graphical effects on it. Ah, uh, force. Drain, goddammit. Forgot about that. I thought it was electric. For some reason. Goddammit. Unlucky. Alright, now they didn't throw off that shield. So they're free. Hell yeah. Probably could have just done single target thunder, but oh well. Yeah, I feel like I'm pretty sure Ma Mudo has a lower chance of hitting than single target Mudo. And single target Mudo is already a low enough chance. Alright, let's get back up to the top four so we can finally finish this. Quick escape is really good. I didn't realize it had such good odds of escaping. It's been like nine times out of ten, honestly. Yeah, I made the right dialogue choices. I was like one frame away from the door, come on. Very unlucky. Get me out of here. Alright, heal, save, and then progress. Finally, let's get out of here. I have no idea how to pronounce that amount of air. 
That's a big bird. I think it's weak to death. But I might be wrong. Definitely save here. Alright, I've got a lot of money. I'm not sure what to do with it. Uh, definitely get Fire Lord. I forget what these are. Those might be good, I don't know. Good Gale on some debuffs. That'll do. Survive. It's only natural. You're just like me. Come on, admit it. Say it, bitch. People sprint. Alright, we need to get our Jill back into the party. At least for her combo. I totally forget what my good, uh, what a good combo setup would be for this, or a skill setup, so I'm just gonna wing it. All I know is that you can do the Argilla combo against her. Against him. Yeah, fuck it. Get him out of the party because he's cursed. Seismic shot, that's a large damage. Let's do this. Probably very greedy, but I'm going for it. I'll dig Hunda the next opportunity I have. We're gonna get hit by fucking AoE Fizz, aren't we? Turn Joe into a bat. God fucking damn it. Okay. Just power charging the guard, huh? Alright, well, there goes that combo damage, but, um, I, at least I can still get the press turn. Oh, it was Dekka. Oh, I fucking got Dekunda and Dekaja mixed up. Why did the game let me do that? Okay. Shit. Actually. Do an AoE fizz and you're fucked. I'm 
not moment. There goes all those turns. Will this do damage to him when he's not guarding? I don't think it will. I'm not gonna risk it. Shit. He's not weak to earth when he's... Oh, he's on the ground. I'm going for it. This is a bad play. Yeah. What was I thinking? Let's look at the press turn. Seems like he only uh, guards in exchange for doing this fucking bat move. Hey, what are we doing? I'll use Cielo's turn to heal. I just don't know what to do for a. Uh... Yeah, fuck it. Cover my bases. Oh, I killed him. I just wasted a fucking mirror. I didn't realize he was so low on health. Oh my god. Okay. Oh well. Jesus Christ. Yeah, that... The double taunt... Seismic shot strats worked out. I did the majority of his health bar on literally two turns. Yeah, my sub notification was the uh, the level up noise. It's not anymore for single subs, but for gifted subs, it, that's the noise oh that it makes. Man. You tree are heavy. <sighs> Do you realize we could share the same fate as them? We all hate, we all fight, we all devour just to survive, but eventually we'll die. I couldn't defend myself we aren't any different from him what's the point then why live like this why are we even that alive that bad yeah Sir, tell me oh that's a lot of uh, mucho texto New hideout. Gunga Ginga moment. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly why those are disabled. Can I get to a save point before a cutscene happens? I think I can. Yeah, if I go through the door, a cutscene will happen. I'll leave that for the next stream. Alright, that is it for today. Thank you guys for watching, as usual. I'm thinking we'll have this game done within the next, like, two streams or so. I'm kind of ahead of where I thought I'd be by now. Anyways, yeah. Uh, who are we rating? Hopefully the chat on screen chat normally will be working next time.
Ship streaming Resident Evil 8. KZ is also streaming Resident Evil 8. Ah. Our red ship. He's a smaller streamer than KZ. KZ is a bigger streamer than I. So, the chain of uh, that's the chain of command. Thank you guys. Uh, I will be back tomorrow, maybe, but definitely not Sunday. Raid ship. <laughs>